relate to this. Um, she says, your mom grew up very, very poor. In early 2000, I was going to school at UC Irvine, and although I was a high school honor roll student, scored high on tests, and spent week after week filling out applications, I was still drowning in student loans. Frustrated and feeling my chance at higher education slipping away, I answered an ad in the Orange County Register newspaper. The large, bold print caught my eye. Girls nude, modeling, earn $2,000 per day. Okay. That's a lot of money. So she started off by doing um, some nude modeling, and then, of course, it uh, turned into um, actual porn movies where she's having sex with people on camera. And at the time, she felt that it was the right choice to make. She felt that, you know, her family wasn't going to find out about it because at that time her family wasn't really using the Internet. Um, but then, of course, things changed, and her mom found out about it. And um, she says that the family, even though they weren't in favor of it, um, they were supportive nonetheless. They still loved her nonetheless. And, no, that's good. It, but uh, there's, I can't help but be slightly abused by it. I'm an honor roll student, but I couldn't figure out that if I put it on the internet, that at some point somebody might see it. All right. Aurora Snow, Rebecca Clary Kingston, a.k.a. Aurora Snow. She got into the business of adult films from 1999 to 2016. And her education was in the American Academy of Dramatic Arts, where she dropped out. Now, she claims that times were tough, and she was a straight-A student, and that she uh, <clears throat> needed the money uh, to attend school. But uh, from the years of 1999 to 2016, it never mentions from her completing the school, or completing her education. Uh, once again... The Western female finds so many loopholes to almost make it seem stoic that her struggle in life is due to the fact that it's all about, you know, financial woes and struggles. So she has to enter the porn business and she has to do these things to achieve what she needs to achieve. Because she wants to better herself. Meanwhile, there's millions upon millions of students here in North America and the Western world with drowning in student debt, trying to pay it off, who are honor roll students who don't go to the porn industry to make easy money. But not just that. Mrs. Uh, Kingston decided to have a child and I'm assuming out of wedlock, because it doesn't speak about the father. And her child is now, she wrote a letter to her child about her past. Which, it just comes to show you how, basically, women hold no accountability in the Western society. None whatsoever. It's always some sort of, like, uh, struggle in life that they had to make these, you know, decisions to to live their life in a way that you know they had to struggle while they laid down on their back and got paid for having blatant sexual intercourse for money but somehow this is some stoic some some grand achievement and not just that now she she involves a kid a kid that basically doesn't deserve this doesn't deserve to be put in the uh, line of fire because of her mother's tawdry past. And when this kid will be brainwashed. He'll be brainwashed. He'll be any sense of, of independence, masculine energy will be weaned out of him. And he'll be shamed for thinking that his mother's less than some angel, some, some goddess. No accountability. This e this is the type of women that are out here. No accountability. Do not hold them accountable for anything, including their past. Got paid for having for having sexual intercourse with random men, Thou hundreds and hundreds of men. And I mean, you look at look at we're, we're talking at least almost twenty years in the service, almost just about not not quite twenty years. We're look, looking at maybe seventeen years in the business. Unbelievable. 
I mean, it it, it it doesn't it doesn't even it doesn't it doesn't even doesn't re respond. It doesn't register in her brain that she's dragging another life into her past, and she's she's totally cool with it. No accountability, gentlemen. No accountability.